With Montana's inaugural high school baseball season approaching, Browning High School Indians are getting ready for their opening day. They will be under the leadership of Coach Douglas Blackman, who has a long history in the sport. I'm pretty excited about it being, uh, I come from a state that is, that is high on baseball. And it'd be nice, it's just going to be nice to get out and teach these kids some baseball, another sport for them to play. But the Browning team is made up of little to no experience, so Blackman had to adjust his coaching priorities. Be a teacher first and compete second. And uh, that's kind of my goal with the kids is teach them, the, the, teach them the, uh, how to play the game and teach them in and out parts of baseball. And basically those wins might come. We'll see. Despite not having a baseball background, these athletes still found reasons to come out for the team. To learn, you know, to learn, to get better, and then, you know, after school, keep getting better and better. It's a lot better for the future, future kids coming up. So I'm happy for them, and I wish we had it when we were freshmen. But before entering the season, they are already facing some disadvantages. When we started, we started in the gym. It was pretty tough teaching baseball in the gym. Uh, but it basically was able to break the fundamentals down even more in the gym. But not having a baseball field has been pretty challenging for these kids uh, laying bases down and trying to learn on, on a football field. No home field to practice on means travel for what is considered to be their home games. We've got to travel to Cut Bank to do our home games. So we don't know what kind of field they look like. We haven't gotten to practice on there yet. So we're coming in pretty green. We're coming in pretty bad news bears style. The Indians will travel to East Helena on Saturday for their first game of the season. In Browning, I'm Dante Williams, MTN Sports.